Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Martin over here, if you still don't know. You can watch some of my other videos for a more deep introduction. I'm too lazy today to make that. And what's on for today's agenda is that I'm traveling to Stuttgart to help my friend Dino film some interviews. And since I'm going to use my main camera to film the interviews, I decided to try out my Note 9, if it's good for YouTubing or not. And uh, I'll just make a typical vlog video or whatever with the, uh, with the Note 9 and uh, I will include uh, info beneath uh, each footage, what feature I used. I'm, I will try to use almost everything this phone has so we can see if it's good or not. So yeah, let's go. interview I will shoot some bureau again and yeah let me know down in the comments what what do you think of the footage until now from the phone So just finished recording the interview and we're gonna head home. I'm going to check the footage from the phone 
and then also record separately um, what what is my experience with it and how useful it was and how easy it was to edit and you already seen what the end product is so uh, but you also hear my personal opinion on the topic by the way also don't forget to leave a comment on the video quality and uh, the audio quality I'm using the built-in mic so uh, yeah make sure to leave your opinion as well on how well this turned out and if you're going to use this phone uh, if you can for YouTubing and um, yeah another thing it's it's lunchtime I'm hungry as hell so see you later hi guys so uh, I just finished editing the video you just saw and um, to be honest I'm really pleased with the result uh, with this phone uh, First of all, the super slow mo. Uh, they, there were two types of super slow mo. One directly slowed down the footage inside your uh, uh, video, and you didn't have much room to edit. Also, it exported it in uh, 720p, which wasn't that good. But if you film in a normal slow mo situation, then you have all the 240 frames per second, and you can slow whenever you want in post processing. Another thing is in manual mode. You can, as you saw, shoot similar to flat image and then you can color grade easier. Uh, you saw after that the color graded normal footage, it was a bit difficult to do it because the image was already uh, saturated a lot and had a lot of contrast and stuff like that. Uh, so definitely uh, you can take advantage of the flat uh, video uh, in the pro mode. Uh, I don't know whether it's a minus or a plus, or it doesn't mean anything at all, but you can only do it in 1080p. You cannot do it in 4K, which is uh, a bit sad. Uh, cool thing is it has really nice stabilization. Uh, all of the footage you actually saw was handheld, because I forgot my mount for the Joby uh, tripod. I'm pretty sure if I use that, uh, which I'm currently actually using to film this, I would have gotten more stable footage, but you can see that you can go 60 frames per second and uh, when slowed down for B-roll, you can get pretty stable shots. And as well, the built-in stabilization is pretty good. So basically, I, I never stopped at one place to shoot. Everything was handheld like literally like this, uh, which is against all rules for uh, stabilized footage. And in general, definitely I'm pretty happy with the phone. And I think I will be using it uh, to make f uh, footage whenever I f forget my DSLR at home uh, because it, in the end it's it's big, I, I cannot always carry it with me or batteries die or whatever. But uh, I really want to hear your opinion on the topic. Um, what do you think from the footage, from the audio? I'm intentionally, by the way, shooting this in poor lighting conditions. The, the light is yellow everywhere around me and I'm just using what's uh, in my living room. Uh, most likely you can see it here on the monitor that uh, the white balance is compensating for a yellow so uh, it, it should be a bit bluish my monitor over there and uh, yeah again uh, would love to hear your opinion on the footage from the Note 9 leave a comment down below tell me what did you like and what you didn't as well will you use it uh, or would you like to get one as a second camera, a third camera or whatever, as a backup in general? And as always, I would love uh, if you haven't done it already to click the subscribe button and uh, the bell icon to get notifications whenever I release new videos. You can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, links are down in the description. And I hope this video was interesting for you as it was uh, interesting for me to make. And yeah, see you on my other videos. Bye guys.